So once your organization set up multi-factor authentication, first time you log back in using Microsoft Online, you'll need to uh, configure it. So we're just gonna walk through that. This particular video is um, how to configure the, um, the Authenticator app. Now, there are a number of Authenticator apps out there, obviously the Microsoft one. Um, there's uh, LastPass, there's Google, there's, there's a number. So you can decide which one you want to use. You don't have to use the Microsoft one. But for this particular one, I will use the Microsoft one. So instead of saying phone, we're gonna say mobile app. Um, you can receive notifications to um, the mobile app, or you can use a verification code from within the app. So there's two ways you can set it up. Um, we're gonna set the first one up, which is the receive notifications verification then what you need to do for, from within the microsoft app you need to scan or well, obviously download and install it first then you need to scan that qr code to authenticate it so there's a little in the microsoft one there's a little plus um you specify it's a work account and then you scan the qr code and it adds it in Okay, brilliant, that's done. Then hit next. Let's just check in the activation status. Then configure notifications. And what it should do next, it should send a message to your app, which it does. And I can now just approve that from within the app. And we're in and then obviously you need to set up a, a mobile number just in case you lose access to the app so you can use it as a as a fallback and there's an app password so this app password would be used if you've got outlook and you don't want to keep um, using the authentication multi-factor authentication on it you can save this password um, so sort of like a one-time password and then you don't need to write it down anywhere you just put it into the app and that's that and finish and that is it. I say no for that. What I'm going to do now is uh, log out and log in just to show you what that looks like now. Okay, signed out and log back in. So this is still your normal password, it's not the app password, don't get confused with that. Yep. And it's now sent me a message to the app saying, do I want to verify it? I say approve and I can tick the box. And now we're in. Okay. I'm going to sign out once more time. Okay, sign in once more. Put in my password. And it hasn't asked me to re-authenticate because now it knows that for 14 days, this device is okay, this application's okay. That's it, straightforward. Um, that app password, obviously you would set up within Outlook or Teams or Skype for Business or any of those that need it. Um, new versions of Office, you can actually just authenticate from within the app. Um, that's straightforward. Any problems, give us a shout.